getting there. I don't know how you remember how to do all this stuff. <laughs> uh, whoops, I, after doing I, it so many times. Yeah, but I, I've been downloading pictures onto the computer too, and I, or onto Facebook and stuff. And for some reason now, some of them won't go. So, uh oh. Uh, Wait till tomorrow. It'll show up. Yeah, there you go. Okay. Hi, Holly. Hello. Oh, there's Miss Holly. Okay, be quiet. Okay. Okay. No, no, not you. <laughs> you, you talk. Hello, Valerie. <sighs> Hello, everyone. Welcome to my craft room. It is a mess because I've been creating with the Abigail Rose suite for two days because it's so pretty. And it's our August club choice and my July class. So stay tuned, more information coming. But tonight we're going to play with this birthday piggy and see what we come up with. I have no inspiration except what's in the catalog. So let's flip, flip you around. There we go. So I have, I got out Peekaboo Farm because they seem to go together and we might want to use them. And I got out dots and spots because we haven't used it for a while, if ever. Some frames, some shapes, and the deckled rectangles. And new Horizons designer paper. Shall we stretch ourselves tonight and do something funky? Everybody's quiet. I've shocked them all. Well, you'd be the one that'll be going out of their comfort zone, not up. <laughs> okay, because I haven't used any of those things because I don't have any of them. Oh, well, there <laughs> you go. Valerie agrees. So in the catalog, that's all there is for the in the piggy so that's where I got the inspiration to do to use the the farm but I don't know I'm thinking so what I was thinking and we'll see if you guys even like the idea is to take the decal rectangle dies and cut, like have a card base. I didn't bring any colors over except for white. So we'll pretend this is our card base. No, it's a little small. We'll just pretend, right? That's our card base. I figured we'd cut three strips, like take a piece of the designer paper, cut it into three strips, like something with a, get rid of the pieces that are not full pieces because they won't work. So we got all of these different designs. So say we chose this one, cut three like this and lay them across on a card. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's not going over well, I can tell. No, what, I'm thinking. What, what would happen if you did it as the underneath piece and you did three holes in the top of something? The same. Do this as underneath and make yeah. windows for it to yeah. go in? Oh. You could even do them different sizes. Yeah. We could. So are they those things basically rectangles with wonky edges? Yes. Oh. Yeah. So they're, they're deckled. They're really cool. I like them. I'd show you how I used it in the past couple of days, but that's secret for right now. So, no. <laughs> In other words, it's something we need to get. Well, it's a class that's coming where you will see how to use them. Hello, Sharon. 
Valerie says she likes the paper, so. I do like that paper, yes. Yes. And I got a bit of it left, so like, I think this is almost a full package. I don't know. Yeah, there's like 36 sheets, so it's not quite, there's 48 in there. If you're gonna use the pig, pigs, you need to use one with pink in it. Pink in it. Yeah, it doesn't matter which one it is, but it has to have pink. Aren't pigs usually pink? Ooh. Unless they've had a mud bath. That's true. <laughs> I don't know. Let's go through. We'll see if there's anything in here that's. If you'd see one that hits your fancy, say now. Of course, over there on Facebook, you're at a disadvantage because your now is going to be four pages past. Well, those are all the same. That's funky. Mm -hmm. Okay, take that one out. And don't forget, there's the other side too. Hey, Peggy. So some, no, some are black. Oh, pigs. Yes, some pigs are black. You're oh, right, Val. Oh, they that's are. true. That's the true. pot belly ones are definitely black. Don't let me forget. I have the last two share it Saturdays that I need to draw tonight. So please don't forget. Yeah, I'm leaving it all up to you guys. Is that so the same that. as the other one? Yeah. It is. Um, this may not work. What about a green one? Mind you, I get, maybe the, I don't know. You're not going to see much of it if you do the window thing. No. That one's cool. That might produce something exciting. That's cool. That's cool. Okay. This one is neat because it could be this way or it can be this way. Okay, so we have a pink one, a seen one, and a green one, and we'll decide from there. I just gotta get it back in here, otherwise, you know, the mess starts early and then I really get in, a, in trouble. Get in there. Oh my God. Especially, is it tomorrow you leave or? No, it's next week. Oh, next week. <laughs> you got me excited to see my grandchildren. I messed it all up. No, this weekend I have my Sunday all day fun day stamping thing. Oh. Oh, right. Yes. Okay, I gave up. <laughs> <laughs> I'm looking for paper. Okay. We'll go between these two first. So we have four, we have a green one, a pink one, a blue one, and a funky one. So let's go first of all, we'll decide between these two, then we'll decide between those two, and then we'll decide between the winners. Pink or blue? Blue. One for blue. Peggy, we're doing this birthday piggy and maybe peekaboo farm and maybe a whole bunch of other stuff that we haven't decided yet. 
Pink. So pink or blue? Pink. Oh, neck and neck. Yvonne says blue. Come on. Anybody else want to chime in? Sharon says blue. Okay, this one's out. Okay, now between the green and the funky. 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 Two for funky. Oops. Get it so that my pencil doesn't go through the paper. Oh, Heather said blue as well. So that's. Oh, and Peggy said pink. Thanks, Peggy. <laughs> okay, so it's blue. But now we're we're voting on. Yvonne is funky. Peggy's funky. Sharon's funky. Val's funky. Heather's green. <laughs> Oh, big surprise, One, two, Heather. <laughs> three, four. One, two, three, four. Okay. Bye-bye, Green. Okay. Last choice. Blue or funky? Funky. Funky. One, two for funky. So we're choosing between the blue and the funky. Peggy's funky. La, 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 la. Heather's blue. Yvonne is blue. Okay, for two to three, Sharon's funky. It's going to be funky. Valerie's funky. Okay, now while I'm doing this, I just want to say that for the May the 14th Share It Saturday, there's only one entry. So if anybody wants to get their name in that draw, go do it now. But do it in another window so you get to, you can come back here again. So I don't want to lose you. Okay. So Janet's idea was to have a piece of paper, not necessarily this size, and cut some different windows in it to see the background and then what have the piggy showing through or something something i don't know you're not going to see much of the color though are you there's going to be some come out behind. And then this one, we'll put maybe the sentiment in there. So is everybody liking this idea? Or, or we can use circles. Or we can use the peekaboo die. So instead of this, these rectangles, oop, they were stuck together because it's magnetic. So instead of those ones, we could use circles. Now they could be all the same size, but I don't have. Let's see, that one, that one, that one, that one, and maybe a sentiment. Valerie likes the ruffled edges one. Okay. Yeah, I like the rectangles, but Janet, was your idea that um, uh, stamp the piggies, color them, and then we can watch Glenda Fussy cut them out to put yeah. them in the window? Okay. <laughs> we have to torment her a little bit. Well, um, and she's good at fussy cutting, so, you know. She is. Can't I just stamp them right on the paper and co color them in? Okay, oh, so they'll we're be too, they'll be too blah mixed up colors. Hey, we're going to choose between the decal or the circles. Which 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 ones would you rather have? The circle or the decal edges? Decal. Decal. Two decals. Valerie likes the decals. Connie likes the decals. Peggy likes the decals. Um, Valerie likes the fussy cutting. 
Yvonne likes the decals. Okay, well, we'll just put the, the circles away. I'm sorry, circles. You are not needed tonight. Go back to sleep. We're going to have to use that, that um, the one I really wanted to use. This one, inside. Okay. So now I need to know <clears throat> what color you want this to be. Oops. I got to put this away or I'll end up like Janet and not know where it came from. Janet, do you want to show that die? Yeah. And I'll highlight you. Maybe somebody knows what they're from, what it's from. Anybody know what this die is from? It's not like Eden's garden or something, is it? Oh, could be. I had it out too. Aha. Uh -huh. Oh, Connie said it's forever fern. Okay, yeah. It, it. But those ones are in the catalog. You said you looked through the catalog. Val says, no, it's not forever fern. I don't think so either. Okay, so while you're all thinking about Janet's missing die, and if you can't find it, Janet, go on to um, Facebook somewhere and ask. Somebody will know what it is. Right. That's true. You can even do it in our group. Okay, so this piece of paper that we're going to cut the holes in and have it in front of this lovely piece of paper. What color do you want it to be? Do you want it to be a pink or a blue or white? Um, I'm just looking at the colors that are here. Green, green would be the other choice. And then when we do that, then we'll figure out which one. So pink, blue, white, or green for this piece of paper. I'm gonna say blue. Valerie said pink. Was that you, Janet? Yes. One blue and one pink. White. One green. Was that white, Holly? Yes. Oh, Connie says white. Got two whites, one for everybody else. Oh, Yvonne says blue. Anybody? Peggy says pink. Okay, so Sharon says blue. Blue's ahead by one. It's gonna be blue. Now, the blue in here is Misty Moonlight, but I don't have it anymore, it's retired. So we're gonna to have to. Okay, so for the blue, do you want it dark, like Night of Navy, or light, like Balmy? I will go and get them. What other blue was in there? Let's see. I'm saying night. Uh, Misty Moonlight is the only blue that's in there. All right. Valerie sent me a message. I'll look at it later, Val. Unless it's a picture for the Share It Saturday, then tell me that. Because that I'll, I'll go and look at and I'll share. Okay. We have... <laughs> Carla says, hello, little piggy. Yes. Navy, dark, and balmy. So we have two for dark and one for light. I'm going to say navy. Your vote is navy? Yeah. What is this piece actually for? Like, It's the one we're going to put the holes in. 
Okay. Or we could do white. Okay, so we have Yvonne says light, Sharon says navy, Carla says navy. So it looks like it's going to be navy. So there's the two colors. There's the balmy blue. There's the knight of navy. Which is a moot point because knight of navy has one. Because it has lots of boats. Okay. So I will cut five and a quarter by, oops, let's not lose this down. I will cut five and a quarter by four, and then you can decide on the size. Okay. So this is going to go over here like this, right? And then the decals. Maybe like that. I? Mm -hmm. Oh, it's Valerie's granddaughter's grad dress photo. Cool. Okay, what are people thinking about that later? Because I put my piggies on blocks, getting ready to stamp and fussy cut, because apparently that's what I'm doing. Oh, so, yeah. do we want, you want to have the whole, the paper at the bottom? like this so that we have the, the blues or do you want it at the top? So bottom or top? Sort of in the, like take in out the middle? off the bottom. <laughs> like that? Yeah. yeah. So you yeah. get more of the colors. Okay, top, bottom or middle? Middle. One for middle middle two for middle the top the bottom or the middle over there in facebook land let's hear from you come on la 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 man either there's a lag or they've all been very going to be very quiet on this one because nobody's posting Okay, well, give you five, four, three, two, one. In the middle it is. Okay, am I just not seeing the boats? What is going on? Hang on. They're probably over there going, oh, my computer's frozen. <sighs> okay, it's back. There, oh, look at all the votes that I missed. Okay, we have bottom, bottom, middle, top, bottom, top. Yes, my computer froze. So bottom, 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 middle, top, bottom, top. Okay, middle and bottom have kind of one. It won't be the top. So, how about if I cut it right there? Now let's ha let's have a look and see where where these windows are going to be. Is this the layout that you're wanting? Sure. Or do you want to do that size there and that size there? Well, 
And then when we do this, then that should be behind there. So then that will be through there and through there. Okay, so I need to cut off. How much do I need to cut off? Two, three quarters off of the bottom. Three quarters off the bottom. And that off of the top. And that. Okay. I think I'm frozen again. Nope. Oh, good. Okay. There's just been no comments since I saw the last one. Good. All right, so there's the paper. Shall I cut these out this way? Is that the smallest of the the one that one that's going on the top, or is that the yeah. second size? It's the smallest. Nope. That's the smallest. This okay. is the second size, and this is the third size. Okay. Okay. So let's vote. Let's vote on the layout. Layout number one is use all three size, sizes. Layout number two is that and then that. So we won't, we'll only have the two sizes. So which do you like better? This one, this one will be cut twice. Be that and that, that's layout number two or that. And that is layout number three. I mean, number one, sorry. One. One. Two votes for number one. Peggy says number one. Carla says number one. Valerie says number one. Oh, wow. Poor number two. Nobody voted for it. All right. Let me get my, my plate. I was using this a lot today. And it's really delaminating, which is not what I wanted it to do. Okay, you like that layout? Mm hmm. Sure. Connie, Sharon, and Yvonne all said number one. So there you go. Everybody likes number one. Okay, Facebook, tell me, do you like this layout? Or should this be up a little bit higher so that it's like that? I don't like that as much, but I'm not. Oh, Yvonne likes it. Peggy likes it. Carla I, likes it. I like it down a bit, yeah. Yeah, I like it down. Okay, I'm going to cut it. I'm going for it. But Glenda, where that plate is delaminating, have you tried like Gorilla Glue or something to no. put it together? I want to see how far it delaminates. Oh, okay. Um, I already reported it to Stamping Up and they've replaced it. And I kind of think that's why they pulled it because there's issues with it. But I want <laughs> to keep using it so that I can see how bad it gets. Yeah, I'm going to assume if they've made it where you can't order it, it's you're not the only person who's had an issue. Nope. Okay, so there we are. It's uh, the same size, so I can, I'll cut it down a bit. Now, card base. Ups, ups a bit. Oh, Valerie wanted it up a bit. Too bad, Val. I didn't see that. Oh, sorry. Um, card base. White or Blackberry Bliss is in there. What else is in there? Don't have Bumblebee, Calypso Coral, nope. Evening Evergreen, nope. Fresh Freesia. Hmm. Yeah, that might look interesting. Might okay. Maybe. Maybe. Oh, 
look, I even have one already cut. Oh, apparently it's not the right size though. Oh, it's six inches. <laughs> okay, it's the wrong size. So there's what it, I have to cut this down and start in the Hang on. I don't like the freeze yet. Uh oh. Okay, we're just going to temporarily put a chunk of tape on. Oops, where did it go? It stayed on there. And we'll put this on here. There. Okay. Fresh freesia. Mm -hmm. Whisper white or basic white. Uh, Carla says blackberry bliss and Peggy says blackberry bliss. Okay, nobody likes freesia. I'm putting it away. What about like polished pink though, too? And I'll put away. Either there, night or navy on night and navy might be okay too. Mm -hmm. And have it popped. I'm assuming that white is a no. No. Okay. Blackberry Bliss. Mm -hmm. Polished pink. Night of Navy. What about Night of Navy with it popped? There's Night of Navy. Yeah, but popped up. Okay, but I don't have any way to simulate that. So well, you'll just have to use your imagination. Yes. Mm -hmm. Because, well, I guess I could put this under there. Well, just give a tiny bit of shadow, won't it? Like that. Okay. Peggy likes Blackberry. Carla likes Native Navy. Native Navy. Native Navy. Okay, so wait, whoa, whoa. Night of Navy or Blackberry Bliss? We have two for Night of Navy. Janet and Holly are Night of Navy. Or Blackberry Bliss. This is just, it's not doing it for me. Okay, Sharon is Navy and Valerie is Blackberry. Peggy's blackberry. Connie's black. Oh, yeah, sure, Connie. Yvonne is navy. Carla's navy. Okay. Blackberry is gone. Polish pink is gone. Yeah, it wasn't good at all, even if I'm the one who suggested <laughs> it. It was a bad idea. There's black. Did you maybe so mean Blackberry Bliss and just put black down for shorthand? Oh, I don't know. That's gone. Okay. Hang on, I'm cutting the base. One night of Navy base. Okay, just temporarily putting it on there so it doesn't run away. 
So we can play with our piggies now. Okay, put that off to the side. Am I stamping on white and cutting out? I'm assuming, but I don't want to. Then you have to color them. Ah, but Carla showed a really cool trick the other day for coloring her piggies. Oh, let's do Carla's way. Well, she, it won't work because we're, we're doing, what she did was she had a, a piece of white she stamped her piggy. Then she used a piece of the new masking paper and put it just over top of the piggy and then did her background and then lifted it off and colored the piggy and it worked really well. Oh, but we're not, cool. we're kind of not doing that. Yeah, you don't need to color the background because you're only coloring, like it's just the piggy that's going to go in after Thanks. you fussy cut them. Thanks. You're welcome. You had to remind me of that, didn't you? <laughs> <laughs> okay, one piggy. Well, I don't want you to miss us too, too much. You know, seems to have this is, I believe, the last co collaboration night for a while. It is. Well, then, you know. And I was going to be, do a surprise pop-up live tomorrow night, but we're getting company, so I have to go and change my post. So if you see the fact that I'm going to be live tomorrow night, ignore it because I'm not. Darn company, yay. I know. To think they're coming over early for the, the thing on Sunday and then we're going to go to Kumi's for the day on Saturday. Nice. I haven't been over there since COVID started. Go to Coombs. Yeah. Oh, yeah, no, I went down before Christmas. We went to a couple of Christmas bazaar market things down there. Oh, yeah. Yeah. What thing on Sunday, Carla? I'm having my, I'm having my Sunday fun day stamping event on Sunday. So it's like starts at 11 and goes till, goes till four-ish. And lunch is included and stamping and bingo and prizes and all sorts of fun stuff. And it's in person. Uh, have you figured your die out, Janet? Connie wants to know. No. Nope. Okay, where are our windows? Here's our piggy wiggies. So now you have to decide which ones go where. And I know I'm not going to fussy cut them all out. So we'll just fussy cut the ones that you want to see. So there's the cake. Because we can only have two if we put a sentiment in here. There's a cake. There's a moped. And there's the flowers. The flowers and the cake seem like they're more um, sized to our window openings. The witch and the cake? Sorry, Didn't the cake you say flowers? And the, the flowers? One? Okay, yeah. those two. Yeah, it just to me that they seem to fit the window sizes better. Connie says layering hugs. Do you have that layering hugs? Um, I don't even know what that one is. Layering hugs. Okay, everybody's agreeing on that. They all want this. Okay, am I cutting the cake out along with the, the pig or just the pig? Well, cake too. Thanks. Make it a birthday one. <laughs> Janet, I was gonna say, if you're gonna like take a picture and put it on like our stamping thing or whatever, um, Take a picture of both the die and stamp the, or cut the die out. Yeah, I can do that. Uh, Cause sometimes they look a little different than the sort of just the die. 
See, Glenda, you are really good and fast at this cutting out stuff. You're just buttering me up. Is it working? No. <laughs> well, I tried. <laughs> oh, I drove by your house the other. Well, actually, I was on my bike. James and I went and went around the dike the other day on our bicycles. Uh, we went by your house. Your front yard is fabulous. Thank you. It, it's, it's getting there. Work in progress. So much better than lawn. Yes, it sure makes cutting the grass a lot faster. <laughs> yeah, it does. <laughs> As I did that today, but it was raining too hard by the time I finished to weed eat. Oh my gosh. What a day. It was so hopeful this morning and the sun was shining and it was warm out there. Yeah, and I had to go to work. Oh. Yeah. I had to go to the post office. And I went to the post office and nobody I knew was in there. Like the, the girls that I usually deal with were not there today. Mm. What the heck is that all about? I'm not really sure. Don't they know I was coming? They should all be working up there. Well, and they should be waiting for you. I know. I haven't been there in a while. Maybe they, they all retired. <laughs> <laughs> Could be. Yeah, it was two people I'd never seen there before. Yeah. I'm sure they, they've worked there, but I've never encountered them. Yeah, it was because I don't go that often that I don't really recognize them but I went to pick up a parcel and do you have ID and I'm okay where where's where's the driver's license is it in my phone or is it you know in my wallet or whatever and she says oh here because I had mail in my hand she says oh yeah no it's fine you know because the address on the mail was the same as what was on the parcel and I thought oh okay. that identifies you really well doesn't it well, I've, I wasn't worried about it because if they had looked, if I am down on record as being allowed to pick up parcels for work, so. <laughs> Carla says, tomorrow is the school track meet. We're going to be stuck in the rain. Aww. Well, Good I Lord hope. Lord, poor kids. I hope that you only get missed if you have to have rain at all. Or a really big umbrella oh and there's norma hello bruce has fallen again norma's partner is away and he keeps calling her when she needs to be online with us like what the heck is that all about she needs to um have words with him she, he needs to get with the program come on well, yeah Okay, just about done. You know how fussy this one is? My God, there is a cake, a balloon, and a tail. Um, no, because I don't have that set. So no, I didn't. So please forgive me. <laughs> sure not. Okay, I'm going to, I don't know what I'm doing down here. We'll do something funky. La la la. la la la. I wonder if they still have sugar free ice cream at Coombs. I don't know, Alyssa but I'm says, guessing yes. you'll find out. <laughs> I will. Carla says, yes, thank you. Let's hope it's light rain or mist. Mm -hmm. Sorry, I had an itch. Am I doing the flower too? You know what I'd answer, so let's. I let's know, I can hear you answer. going, of course. <laughs> And Janet, are you just 
not going to vote? You're afraid to say something? No, I was muted. I think oh, if you were... cut the one off by the tail, I don't think you'll see it. That's a good point. Oh, yeah, you will. Oh, I tried. That was really nice of you to try, Janet. Sharon wants to know if there's a number on your die piece, Janet. Oh, I don't know. I never looked at I don't at think that so. Thing. I think it's too thin, but have oh. a look. No, there isn't. Valerie says yes to the flowers. Thanks for your support, Val. Oh. Okay, this is going to take me a while. So do we want to play Christmas carols or something? Because I think it'll be Christmas by the time I'm done this. Oh, I think it might be a little early for Christmas carols. Oh, I don't know. Tuesday, my Christmas stuff arrives. I might have to do a, an unboxing with my team. So we can see the new stuff. You did get your order in early. I didn't get it in until, what was it? Like 4.30 or something. But all of the orders that I put in that day. So I had my in color club had to go in too. They all shipped today. Hmm. That's nice. Okay. I can't see the flowers in the way. Yes, I'm glad that they're going to be here before we leave because then I don't have to worry about them sitting here unloved and tell Heather to come over and drool all over them for me. Yeah, Heather might open them all up and try them all out. <laughs> Good for her. Yeah. I would have no control over that, would I? None. And it would only be right of her to, you know, check them out to make sure that everything worked. Ah, uh, yes. Well, I only got, only got two of them, two, two sweets. I didn't get a lot, but. One is the gnomes, and I'm really excited to see the gnomes because they're fun. Do you see how much trouble I'm having going around these stupid flowers? Just saying, Miss Holly. But you're doing such an excellent job. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Carla says it's never too early for Christmas and she would love them for me. Thank you, Carla. I know it's a sacrifice for you and I appreciate the sacrifice. <laughs> Valerie said, you said my order would be here on, this, on the 17th, but is Richmond as of this afternoon? Oh, the 17th of June? Is that what I said? You sure it wasn't the 7th? <laughs> Okay, there's probably a typo because I can't see it taking until the 17th of June to get to you, Val. Unless you've moved and you now live in like outer Mongolia or something. La la la, come on. Oh. Okay, well, if you I are. If you, if, pardon me? We're just going to hire you whenever we need fussy cutting done. I will never fussy cut these pigs again with the flowers ever. <laughs> so just saying, if you want me to, the flowers are coming off next time. Aren't you glad, though, that, I mean, you've done it now, so you know you don't want to do it with flowers again? <laughs> I mean, because otherwise you'd just be wondering. I would always wonder not. <laughs> But look what a good job she did. Yes. Carla said it would be rough, but I would do it for you. The loving my stamps. Okay. 
Oh, the 17th. Hmm. Well, is, was that your BOGO order, Val, on the 17th? Because, yeah, that can't be right. Because the stuff that's shipped today is going to be here on Tuesday, which is the 7th. Well, look on the bright side. This is a bonus that it's coming way earlier than you thought it was coming. Well, that's what she said, but it had to be a typo on my part because that's ridiculous. Sounds like. Well, if it was going up north to Terrace, it would be that long. <laughs> well, if you go to rural Saskatchewan, it takes all over two weeks to get it there. Yep. No, oh, the bogo, yeah. There was a typo, Val. All right. We have our piggies. Oh, won't they be cute when they're colored? What? I got to <laughs> color them too? Yes. Well, yeah. Okay. Pink for the pig. Let's try light flirty flamingo. Oh. No. Let's try light polished pink. Because there was a color. Oh, God, no. There was a color that I discovered for pigs that is perfect. And now I can't remember which one it was. No. Blushing oh, bride, maybe? I think it's, we don't have blushing bride. Oh, we don't. Oh. Not in blends. No, I think it was. I think it was this one. That one there. Okay, the other one. The other one would be petal pink. So, this one, number one. Or this one, number two. What color do you want the pigs? Okay, can't see that. Why is it not focusing? Can one. you see that enough to make a decision or do I need to make it bigger? One. That's one. That's two. Yvonne says one. This is one. one. That's two. So that's three votes for one. Yeah, I was going to say one. Two is probably more natural, but one's going to look way better. Connie's one, Valerie's one. Okay, so one. One. It's the loneliest number that you've ever seen. There's a song about that, you know? Mm hmm And now you've all turned off your sound so you don't hear that. These piggies are so cute. At least I don't have to fussy cut them anymore. Okay, what color is the cake going to be? Hello, telephone. The piggy's cute. Oh, the piggy's cute. Mm -hmm. There we are. Oh, he's cute. Are they both? Yeah. I think so, yes. 
Norma, yes, I ordered the gnomes. They're in the new holiday catalog, so in the pre-order. Do we want this piggy to be um, pink too, or do we want him to be brown? Pink. Pink. Valerie wants the cake to be purple. Shades of a chicken card. Oh my God, don't go with that chicken card. <laughs> okay, over there in Facebook, am I doing the second pig pink too? Valerie says pink. Sharon says pink, okay. Pink it is. So we're trying to decide if we want to go to Cuckoo's for lunch on Saturday because we're going to Little Bavaria for dinner. And I think I kind of want to go there hungry. Yeah. Oh, I didn't do his tail, her tail. Could be a him. Maybe we'll, pardon? It could be a him, because pink pigs are hymns. Aren't they look like girls. So. We should give them sparkly toenails. Okay. <laughs> Okay, two pink pigs. Now they're snouts. Get a size darker. Let's try it here first. Oh no, don't like that. We'll use this one. Okay. okay. There's the paper. Oh, wait, gotta put some dirt on him. On my crumb cake. Color is dirt before we put him in there. This dirt reminds me of pig pen. <laughs> now I got that stupid one, it's the loneliest number song going through my head. There we are, dirt. Pig. Pig. Come on. Get in there. Yes? Yes. And yellow what? flowers and a yellow balloon. Yes. And a rainbow cake. And a rainbow cake, including purple. Okay, let's let's vote on the flowers and the balloon. Flowers and balloon, we have yellow as a suggestion. Gonna need something funky. Everybody, a oh, purple cake, 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 purple. Okay, is everybody okay with yellow flowers and a yellow balloon? Yes. Oh, over there in Facebook world.
Everybody likes yellow flowers. Okay. Take them out. Okay, I got a new song going through my head now. Daisy, Daisy, tell me your answer true. More there we are, dead silence again. I was going to say, I'm half crazy <laughs> for the love of you. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Glenda. It. Now I've You're got welcome. that one. <laughs> well, why should I be the only one? True. Could be worse. It could be a Christmas carol. Yes, I could do that. It's okay. I just finished making 50 Christmas cards. Oh, my God. Okay. On the center of the flowers. Oh, oh, oh don't quit because you got the end of your, your um, cake um, candle. Candle. Oh. Fine. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> I guess if I took this off that, you'd be able to see it better. Okay, green. Granny apple or parakeet for the leaves? Parakeet. Sure. Okay, granny apple. Or parakeet. We have two votes for parakeet. So that's for the the leaves. There's two of them. Oh, everybody's going parakeet. It's going to take me an hour to put my blends away when we're done. Yep, everybody wants parakeet. Okay, there's that one done. So let's just slip him in there, her in there. Get a temporary tape on the back so that it does not move. Oh, you know what we should have done? I just thought of something. If we had had them this way, they would be looking at each other. What's wrong with that? Well, do it. Well, put the pig down here. Like no. have that, that hole there. What's wrong with the way it is? The pig's in the air. Well, got dirt under him. Technically, he's got dirt on him. Under him. <laughs> Hang on. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to fake it. I'm just going to turn this around like that. Have him here. I think I'll leave that tail out, though. I'd I like shoot. that better because I don't, didn't like him looking the wrong way. There. That's cute. I like that better. Okay. And of course, you still have to color the cake. I know. I hear you. Purple, I hear, was the suggestion. Yes, I heard that. Okay, where'd I put my dies? This one's going to go here. This one's going to go here. And this one's going to go there. Why okay. do you have to cut a new one? Because that's upside down and I don't use my dies upside down. Sorry. Doesn't happen. Okay. Ever. I did a swap once. I received a card that was all die cuts and every single one of them was upside down. Apparently you didn't like that. <laughs> no, I did not. 
I am ashamed to say I threw it away because I couldn't stand looking at it. Maybe she had eye issues. Yes, that could be. Very possibly, probably more likely last minute Lucy and wasn't checking close enough. Yeah, yeah, that could be. Because that would be me. <laughs> Your middle name, Lucy? No, no. No, but That's lots of times my first name is Lucy, as in last minute Lucy. <laughs> my confirmation name was Lucy, Lucinda, after my grandma. Get confirmation okay. name? Yeah. You get an extra one when you're confirmed? Yeah. Okay. Oh. I did. There we, we go. That was my grandmother too. Interesting. Evelyn Lucinda. Ah, I know. I think I met my grandmother once when I was two months old. I bet you don't remember. Nope, I do not. And then she passed away, unfortunately. Yeah, and then my I, grandfather followed not too long after. I met that particular grandma once when I was five and a half, I guess. Okay, that one doesn't look good. We'll make the candle that. Okay. One purple cake. Shoot, even the coloring of the cake is fussy. Aren't you glad I didn't push for a rainbow cake? <laughs> there. I would have, but it's too small. Now I need a parakeet party plate. Parakeet party plate. Well, that way it matches the other one with the leaves. Oh, yeah, good idea, Janet. A little bright, but that's okay. It's a kid's card, mainly. I don't like this. Oh, I like it, Glenda. No, no, I don't like this cutting. I have to take this piece out. I know, good job. <laughs> I'm nothing if not fussy. I, I think sometimes that Janet might be your twin. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm not as good a cutter as she is. <laughs> not quite as much practice. But 50 Christmas cards already? How many are you going to make? No, they're not for me. Mm. Those, those, oh no, I probably make 75 just for me. Hmm. But I give Christmas cards to a lot of people that are single with a little something. Ah. Uh, I have fun. Well, that's very nice. Don't we all? Christmas is giving from the heart. Mm -hmm. Or the craft room. Yep. Or the heart in the craft room. There you go. <laughs> yep. Okay. So, Piggy. Piggy, get underneath that frame. Come on. You are becoming annoying. Sure, now the frame moved. And then this one under here. Come on. There. His tail over the edge. That's oh, cute. that's cute. <laughs> Okay, so I'm putting them down flat then, I'm assuming. Okay. 
don't watch what adhesive I'm using because this is difficult to put stamp and seal on these little tiny things. La 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 la. Oh, my tape just ran out. All right, be annoying. Oh, we're keeping you up. Well, you know, it is just about quarter after nine. Is it really? Uh -huh. Nine half time flies when you're having fun. Yes. Okay. So now while those glue dots dry, somewhere that I'm not going to put my fingers in them, what kind of sentiment do you want on there? So the sentiment in here. There's the ones from the stamp set. This little piggy says, happy birthday. Sure. Or yeah. go to your happy place and stay there all day. Yeah. Or just happy birthday. Where did it go? Oh, it's your birthday. Oh, I'm thinking, am I not seeing this? Okay, so there's option one. There's option two. Somebody said we. Yvonne likes this little piggy says happy birthday. We could put a, a we on there too. Okay, so it's your birthday or this little piggy says happy birthday. This little piggy. This okay. little piggy. That's three. Carla wants it's your birthday. And we. So she wants it's your birthday. And then we. So far, this the uh, this one is winning. Okay, I know there's another block in this mess somewhere. No, it needs white. Oh, we got. We got another of this little piggy, so that's four, and another we, and it's your birthday, so that's two. Sharon says little piggy, this little piggy and we. Oh, yeah, be different, Sharon. I don't have enough fingers. We before it's your birthday. This little piggy. Oh, I'm going to have to do that with Maggie when I get up there. I haven't done this little piggy with her toes yet. So John. much I miss doing with her that I did with the other kids. There's also the Johnny one. Oh, yes, Johnny. When I was a kid, we went next door one day for some gathering thing and she we were doing this little or johnny johnny whoops johnny whoops johnny johnny and all the adults there didn't get it and i'm the only one that got it to this day i remember that because i was so shy that i crossed my arms afterwards and that was the the clue to getting it right was to cross your arms afterwards <laughs> Thank you. 
Okay. We. Man, I've done a lot of cutting tonight. Oh. There. Okay. These guys are dry, so let's get them in. And then we can put down the, the frame. Oh, I guess I should put the frame on first before I put that one on. Okay. Oops, and this this one too. Just stuck to me again. Okay, tool. Lift that up. Pop the other one under there. Voila. Oop. Lost my wee. This is cute, guys. Hello? Are we out there? You said that yellow balloon really pops against the blue in the background. Yep. We should put the... Um, we should put... Where did it go? Oh, oh, fell down. We should put the shimmery crystal effects on there. Did they retire that stuff? I don't remember. Oh, you wanted we this to pop, up, that. Janet? Yeah. Dang. No, leave it the way it is. Nope. I'll put big ones. We didn't vote on it. Oh. Yvonne agrees it's cute. Okay, so we're voting. Flat or pop it up? before I put any more things on there. So if you can see here in the corner, that's what it will look like if it was popped up. And in this corner, that's what it will look like if it's flat. I think it needs to be popped. Everybody's saying popped. Okay. So hang on, let's put these on and I'll put my what should do them on here? What's that thing called? Embossing buddy. Ooh, the embossing buddy's coming back. It's in the new catalog. Really? Yeah. It's in there with um, the the things for embossing powder. And what else was in there? There was something else that was in there too. 
Ooh, Tuesday, I get my real life in person catalog. Yay! So those of you from my team who ordered them, they will be in on Tuesday. Mm. Nice. And Carla, that's the order with your dies in it. Come on. <coughs> There's a cloud of cornstarch. <laughs> Okay, get rid of the cornstarch. I've had these black dimensionals since they came out and that was what, three years ago? And I haven't used them yet. So I figured it was about time. Some in the middle. Never even noticed. Do they still have them in yep. the book? Yep. They do. They're a combo pack of one, two sheets of minis and one sheet of big ones. Hmm. There we are. Now, the only problem is it's full of cornstarch, so let me get rid of it. Oop, that was adhesive. Oh, that's so adorable. Hey, this little piggy says, now where'd my wee go? Uh-oh. Upside down. This needs to be popped. Mm-hmm. That poor guy on his bike has been has been ignored all night. I guess Good you thing. need to do another one. Oh my god, I couldn't die cut. I couldn't fussy cut that. Look at all the confetti coming out of his butt. No, cut the sign off. Oh. We'd let you and then you could put it on the inside. Yeah. Oh, how sweet. You know, I can stamp it on the inside. It doesn't have to be fussy cut. That's true. Yes. But I would do it in the other corner, the yeah. bottom right. Okay, do you want the wee there? Valerie says you can go on the inside or the envelope. Yep. Okay. Is that where you want the we? Sure. Hokey pokey. I think I'll yeah. put it flat though. It looks like it needs to be flat. That's cute. That's cute. Okay. Need to put the winky on here. Uh oh. And his snout, and his feet, and the candle. I, I would like to put that crystal effect stuff on there, but it was going to it would take a while to dry, so we'll do it the very last thing. Okay, while you're deciding bling or no bling, I'm going to get a piece for the inside. Of Thank you. 
Bling or no bling? Bling. Oh, Valerie says bling. Okay, I'm getting that overwhelming feeling because everything is overwhelming me at the moment. So hang on while I move stuff. Anybody want some deckled rectangles? I have six of them. <laughs> there, okay, we're good now. Everybody's, oh, Connie says no bling. Everybody else says bling. I think I you're think, gonna be voted. I think that if you're gonna, I, I'd like to see the crystal effects in the middle of the balloon in that little blue thing that, whatever it's called, the shadowy thing of the balloon. The shadowy thing of the uh, balloon? The like, little triangle thing, the little, or teardrop. Oh, teardrop only, thing. only in there, not in yeah. the whole thing. Do you want me to color that? I didn't color that. And I think we should sponge on the inside. Happy birthday to you. You live in a zoo. Hey, where did I put the envelope? This one on the envelope? Because he's facing the right way? Sure. Yes. Because you know I take over when it comes time for the envelope, right? Well, and you try leading all the way through it. Sorry. <laughs> 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 Valerie says, ooh, yes to sponge. Okay, what color am I sponging on the inside? Blue. Blue. Yeah, I think blue. And we should color the candle on the um, envelope. Just Valerie the candle. Candle on the envelope. You notice she took over and she's copying? Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, no, I was told to do the candle in the envelope. I'm doing the candle in the envelope. <laughs> You're going to give you a bad time, Brenda. Sure, go ahead. Okay. Because you know what? All I have to do is say bye-bye. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, what blue? Navy. Yeah, navy. But oh, just, but just like on the edge. Do you want it sponged or do you want me to use a blending brush? If you use a blending brush, it's very soft. Yes. So the question is blending brush or sponge? Blending brush. I like the blending brush. La 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 la. While I'm waiting for them over there, I'm going to take the drink of water because I'm thirsty. In my brand new Orchid Oasis water bottle, water cup that is hot and cold. Ooh. Very nice. Yes. Everybody, oh, wait. Sponge, sponge, brush, brush, Janet and Holly, Kate's brush. Okay, I'm gonna move things out of the way so I can be very light with this because I imagine you don't want it too dark. No, no. Yeah. 
So apparently when we go up north next week, we're going to have quite the trip through the canyon because it's pilot car oh. from somewhere around Jackass Mountain right to Spence's Bridge. But if we go up over the Coquihalla, section. Yeah. If we go up over the Coquihalla, it's the same thing. Well, at least they're working on it. Yeah. And if we go Duffy Lake, it's the same thing. And we're going to have our trailer on behind. So it should be quite the trip. Okay. How's that? Like it. Looks good. Am I coloring anything on this guy? No. No, I think he's okay. Nothing? No color? Well, you can really? do the egg if you really want to. We don't mind. She's making it confetti. I'm continuing on with the yellow theme. That works. There. You do a little headlamp too if you wanted. <laughs> ah! There you go. Why don't you go through Whistler? Uh, Duffy Lake is the same, Yvonne. They have their stop and go and pilot car. And then you have the whole hill to deal with. And can you imagine stopping on a hill with our trailer? That would not be a good thing. No, and you'd end up being stopped right at the most inconvenient spot. Yeah, it's ugly towing a trailer through the Whistler Duffy Lake Road anyways. We've done it. It's not nice. Of course, I sleep the whole way, so it doesn't matter to me which way we go. <laughs> Poor Ted. He gets to have his anxiety attacks all by himself. Oh, Valerie said color is bike. What color purple. do we? Purple. Oh, I know what I have to do. I have to get a little bit of glue behind that candle because I didn't do that and it's sticking up. Come on. And here. There. Yes, color the bike. Okay. Or purple bike. Sure. I don't remember what color I used. It's Highland Heather, I think, wasn't it? No, wait. No, Fresh Freeze, yeah. Okay, I'm coloring the bike. Should color it the same way that my bike used to be. Mine with gold. Mm. Till I had my accident and then the front end was blue and the back end was gold. <clears throat> Everybody needs a purple bike. One purple bike. Here we are. Cute. It is. There's our front. 
There's our inside. There's our envelope. And look at that. It's not even 20 to 10 and we're done. And you need some of that special effects, whatever. Oh, yes. Called. I'll put that on. And don't let me forget the draw. Did anybody go put their card in the, the one for the 14th? No. Well, Janet's is there. Janet will be the winner. Oh. Janet will be the winner if nobody else goes over there. Well, Janet's really lucky, so she probably would be the winner <laughs> anyhow. <laughs> I really should look and see if we still have this stuff in the catalog. We got the puff paint back though. That's gonna be fun at Christmas time. Mm -hmm. la, 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 la. I like I would do that and then I shove my hand in it. <laughs> well the secret to this stuff is when you store it store it like this so it's always up at the tip and the air bubble is at the bottom oh, okay that shines quite a bit doesn't it yeah and you can't put it on top of something that you've colored with a regular marker and you can't um, put it on top of something that's been stamped with the regular water-based inks because it runs. Hmm. Apparently it's quite thick right now. Yeah, I'll put a second coat on it comes time but it gives the balloon a shine that is cool isn't that cute mm -hmm. <laughs> valerie i've already said to you thank you cards i'm sorry i'm sorry you'll have to put another order in <laughs> that is a cute card it is i love it i love it okay i gotta clean up a little bit here so i can find my computer Put those over there. Put these all over here. Then I won't put my arm in them. That goes over there. These can go away. Didn't use that one, so we'll put it back. In there. Why is my phone doing weird things? I don't think I put it on do not disturb. Okay, I'm going to move this before I put my arm in it. My book away. Hey, there's a computer. Okay, so congratulations to Janet for winning our May the 14th. Share it Saturday. Hey, draw. Janet. Hey, Janet. <laughs> <laughs> okay now let me get my other i got the wheel already set up and then i'll share my screen okay can you see the wheel yeah all right pull it down a bit take off the title okay here we go this is for may the 21st and the winner of that draw is Terry. Congratulations, Terry. Congrats, Terry. Very nice, Terry. So just hang on a sec till I figure out what I'm doing here. Get everybody back. And put this there there we go yes congratulations to janet and terry our latest winners so while i'm away the share it saturdays will still happen and i'll do the draws when i get back 
and I will be live on Monday. Don't remember what I'm doing, but it'll be something fabulous. It won't be the pigs, unfortunately. Um, and have a wonderful weekend. I think it's going to rain, but you know, we have our craft rooms, so we can be in our craft rooms. Yes. And ooh, it's a little close. There we go. Anybody else got anything they want to ask? Janet. Janet, that died. Let me get my other catalog if you can find it. Real quick. This is last year's catalog. You think it might be in this one? It could. I have no idea. Oh. Okay, then. I'll find the dies. Oh, do you have penned flowers? Can you hold it up again? Mm, nope. Nope. Hey, let me find my, let me find my hands. There. No, oh, it's not penned flowers. Well, there was lots of dyes last year, apparently. It's not the birthday chick one, just in case you were wondering. It's one of those ones that when we find it, it's going to be, well, of course. Exactly. That's okay. I'll just keep it with the other two that I have found. And one day I'll find it. Well, I haven't given up yet. So got one more page. Nope. Not in that one. Maybe it was in the year before. Take a picture of it. I took a picture. And I, I will put it. Yeah. Are you part of Demonstrator Planning Place on Facebook? Because that's a good place to ask. Okay. All right, everybody. <laughs> Valerie says thanks for the extra kilometers on her on her ride she rides her she rides her stationary bike while we're stamping that's a great idea good idea maybe i should try that <laughs> um it'll be interesting watching you fussy cut and ride a stationary bike at the same just time thinking that. Uh, you never know what i'm going to come up with right okay but leave that that's All right. true so everybody has a go ahead I was going to say, I don't think Crystal Effects is in the new catalog. No? Oh. Well, it could be. I just didn't see it. Yeah, I, th oh. I thought they had retired it, too. But that's okay. For some of us, it's not retired because we still have it. That's right. And if you don't have it, you can always use the, the glue, the, that fine tip glue. That works really well for balloons and, and windows and patent leather shoes. Hmm. It was during the bingo. Oh, oh, right. The BOGO. She, while she was, while we were doing our little chit chat and sessions, she was riding during the BOGO. I got it. So the BOGO is still going on. There's still stuff in there if anybody is interested. And if you want, if you live local and you want to come see the stuff in person, well, let me know and we'll make time for that too. I don't have anything else. That's it.
Well, so, thank you and have a great weekend. Yeah, same. I lost the card. Oh, there it is. I was going to hold the card up once more. That is so cute. <laughs> That's cute. It is. Well done, ladies. Once again, much better than the chicken one. One day I'm going to remember to look for that chicken one so I can refresh your memory. It was not good. Oh, yes. Have a boo at Grace's. Sorry, Val. I completely forgot about that. So let me, I've got it up. I'll share the screen so everybody can look at Valerie's granddaughter in her grad dress. Holy oh, yeah. man. That's gorgeous. Very, very pretty. Bring it up. I love the color. Go any bigger. Yeah. Isn't that? That's, That's definitely a mermaid dress. Yeah. That's beautiful. Oh, very nice, Val. Thanks for sharing that. These kids are so grown up. I know. Yeah. Can I ask a crazy question? Sure. Anybody know what you do for going from grade seven to grade eight? What do you mean by do? Well, I have a granddaughter that's going from grade seven to grade eight, and apparently they're having guests come on the last day of school to do this graduation. Well, when James was in school or, or when James and Cameron were in school, we, th they would have a graduation ceremony for the ones that were going from up to grade eight. So do you, so do you do a grad card for that? Yeah, I guess you do. I never did. Okay, so I know we were going to say goodbye, but I have a friend who shall remain nameless who keeps finding these pictures on the internet and sharing them with me. So have a look at this as we say goodnight. Oh, it's a Vietnamese mossy frog. It almost looks like it's a brooch or something, eh? Yes, it looks like it's made out of beads. Because I got to tell frog. you, mowing the grass today, something startled me, and I instantly thought of you, Glenda. I thought, ah, my God, it's like a bloody bullfrog. Because he, he had to be, like, he would have fit, covered my full palm of my hand. Oh, my God. Like, it's okay. He startled me. He didn't scare me or anything because it was just a frog. But I thought, just a frog? Yeah. In my world, just a frog. You know, if it didn't have any legs and it was slithering along, then I'd have been <laughs> doing something else. But in my world, it's just a frog. <laughs> it's a frog. But it's the biggest one I've seen, I think, since we lived at the lake. Wow. Well, you live down there, there's kind of, is it damp down in behind you? You're kind of on the dike thing there, aren't you? Yeah, it can be. Um, and I think he's living under like the, the deck by the pool where it's also would be very uh -huh. damp. Well, thank you very much, but I won't come swim in your pool. <laughs> I don't let them swim in the pool. That uh -huh. would be even in the area. No, uh -uh. It's another yeah. reason why we're selling the cabin. I can't stand the frogs anymore. Oh, well, that's too bad. But, you know, they're going to miss you. They're going to miss getting killed. Because when I was up there, there was never any live frogs left. Oh, nope. Because the water belongs to me when it. If it's not swimmable water, it doesn't matter. Like if it's too cold for me to swim, it doesn't matter. They can have it. But if it's swimmable and I can swim, they're not there. Um, it, yeah. Can't you? Yeah. Just scare them away. No. There's a rope that goes because our cabin is a float cabin. So it's tied by rope to shore. And the rope hovers just on top of the water. And they sit on that rope like oh wait you can't pretending touch, they're they're like they're this. crows they sunbathe on that freaking rope 
and they sit there and watch me. Nope. Yes. Nope. No frog is alive when I'm there. Mm. Okay, there's millions more to replace them. That is true. <laughs> All right, ladies. Thanks over there in Facebook. I appreciate you joining me and have a wonderful weekend. We'll see you on Monday night at eight o'clock. Bye for now.